session template. So the session template is pretty simple, but it gives you a good starting point to just open and start working. The first thing up here is a video track. I just named it video because I also, through my subproject script, I take the video and put it in the subproject. I just have a video track in every session when I start. And this next track is a folder track with children tracks underneath it. Basically, we take away the use for having to route very complicated aux sends and masters and all of that. And basically, it's, it's this amazing thing that if you drag a track, it can be its own track. Or if you drag it into the middle of, this, of another track, it becomes a child to that track. Basically, it buses to this. And this main track is the main send where you could put in effects or whatever you would like. It's made making sessions super simple compared to Pro Tools. And then down here is the LFE track. The LFE track has an effect on it. It's uh, the built-in RIA surround plugin, and it's just going to the LFE. So already you have your LFE routed and ready. And then I just have an extra uh, instrument track that is ready for any instrument. Uh, the thing I forgot up here is there's actually an effect on the video track, and um, I use this surround pan plugin a lot. It's actually a better plugin, in my opinion, than the built-in RIA surround. So in my session template, I use this plugin, and that's why on the website you can see that this is a requirement. And it's just a requirement in that when you open the session, it'll say this is missing if you don't have it. And I have a link on the website to the exact page where you can download it. So that's just the session template. It's a pretty bare-bones template, but it gets you up and running really quickly.